Welcome to Kenya Finland. Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, wherever you are. Today I'm going to take you with me for grocery shopping. I'll show you around my neighborhood and uh, basically just enjoy the nature. After this, I'm going to do a mini haul of the things that I'm going to buy from the shop just to give you an idea of the prices of food in Finland and then you can make a comparison to price of grocery from where you come from. Yeah, it's a very beautiful morning. How are you doing? How is this pandemic thing treating you? How is your Sunday morning? Have you gone to church? Are you at home? Uh, are you working? How's your day? Please comment and share. Let me know how you're doing, how you're faring on, how life is treating you. I hope you are all in good health and spirit and that you're taking good care of yourselves. Yeah. That is quite often put because uh, teenagers like to drive uh, motorbikes late at night and they like um, compete with each other and they make so much noise in the residential areas. So that basically says you cannot drive a car or a motorbike here in this area. I wish they could put something like that also where I live because uh, it can get very noisy especially during summer when it's very light. Yeah, fall is here, leaves are drying and are falling down. So weather is changing very rapidly as we get ready to embrace summer, not summer, sorry. Um, fall and then winter so even the trees start shedding leaves and uh, during winter the trees quite often just don't have any leaves on them anymore so yeah today we are going to the shop so I want to see if I can show you guys a few things here and there. Yeah. Yes, I forgot to mention where we are going for or where I'm going for grocery shopping. So it's called Talk Money. So it's a departmental store where I'm going to do the shopping. So let's go. So now let me. So what I got, spinach, um, let me get the price, the baby spinach was uh, 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 189, like 1 euro 89 cents, so that's like um, a round off to Round off to 190 kg shillings. Sugar, 1 kg. Sugar, 1 kg cost 75 Kenya shillings. That's 72 euros, 75 Kenya shillings. That's just uh, um, some type of uh, menthol. Mental terms, uh, I bought those for 100 bob, 91 cents, euros. I bought vitamin D and C supplement because in Finland they are sold in the supermarket also. That was 700 Kenya shillings, about 7 euros. I bought batteries, double A, six pieces for three euros 99 cents. That's like 400 Kenya shillings. I bought um, some type of uh, sweets, chocolate thingy 
for one euro that's like 100 bob we'll just make a uh, rough round off about bread mushroom half um 450 grams that's uh cow of a paletta this is made from wheat and uh that was one euro that's like 100 bob kenya shillings this is a big bread this is like family size bread and uh, in the video you see I'll insert there, I showed that uh, the wheat bread half kg was going for one euro. Like I always say, bread is cheaper in Finland than it is in Kenya. I mean, if it's cheaper in your area, please feel free to comment. I thought about four bananas for 75 cents. That's like 75 Kenya shillings, so 80 bob. I bought peanuts half kg kg of peanuts and that cost me uh, 1 euro 79 cents so that would be more like um, what? 180 bob Kenya shillings for half kg that's expensive in Kenya you get probably 1 kg for the same price about yogurt um, that's 150 gram yogurt this is pe uh, persica Pas um, apricots and uh, more stick uh, that's like uh, blackberries and um, oops uh, wrap up berry raspberry and um, each was going for 89 cents euros so that's more like uh, 90 Kenya shillings I bought the famous Kumawiki. I mean, I want you guys to understand how expensive this is. This is 200 grams. And this is not the best quality of Kumawiki. Like, it's chewy, it's hard. It's the type of Kumawiki that they sell back in my village when it's, um, when there's a drought. Like, it's very, very chewy. And that cost me two euros 89 cents that's more like um uh, mm, 295 kenya shillings this one's when i cook it's just to be eaten by one person with ugali and that's it yeah so if you visit a kenyan in finland and they serve you ugali and skumawiki please be thankful it's very expensive Kumawiki is more expensive than meat in Finland. I, I'll show you in the video where um, one kg of one kg of um, fillet, like a pork fillet, is going for seven hundred Kenya shillings only. So that's very cheap. I bought some uh, some easy food that you can just throw in the oven, and uh, this is not worth mentioning because you cannot compare it to the Kenyan market. So. I bought this. This is probably something worth mentioning. Apples in Finland are very cheap. So this was like 1.25 kg for, for, for 1 euro 25 cents. This is just like uh, soup and soup and soup. Different types of soup. Each one for 1 euro 75 cents, 1 euro 80 cents. And uh, basically, it's just for the purpose of um, for the purpose of making my life easy during um, during the beginning of the week because I'm going to be very busy. So that was uh, the whole shopping list. As you can see, I did not come back with much, and I ended up paying. that much 33 euro and 30 cents that's more like uh, 3,000 Kenya shillings 400 for just few few things you cannot even feed a family with this it's like a joke yeah thank you if you like this video please like and subscribe